Welcome back, folks. Here we are once again. Ah, carrots have barely any, like, sustenance on them, huh? I'm gonna go ahead and eat some real quick. So last time, we, uh, wanted to get a propane torch and stuff so that we could remove some of the extra, like, sinks, not sinks, sorry, the, uh, fridges and, and stuff like that that were around here. Because if we, uh, did not... <clears throat> well, we'd be running into an issue where we won't be able to have our generator going, right? So it would uh, inevitably lead us to wasting a bunch of fuel. So we have to get rid of the generators that are around, not the generators, sorry, the, the refrigerators and stuff that are around us, right? And uh, that's one thing that we want to get done. So we had previously gone to a hardware store in which we found absolutely nothing. It was not great. <clears throat> I mean, we found some stuff. We found a bunch of crowbars, for example, um, <clears throat> that's still down in our van, but we didn't find the propane torch. We have a welding mask, but no propane torch to cut stuff down. So I looked around and I was trying to find some places that could potentially have some like, uh, geez, what do you call them? Uh, sheds behind the, the building, right? Behind the houses, essentially. And looking at the map, I think the closest place that would have them, judging by just how stuff looks, would be down here, these locations. Now, I'm not entirely sure if these are sheds or if they're, you know, houses and then smaller houses on the side or, or what they are but I think if we get down to this location we will be able to maybe find a propane torch so that's gonna be our plan for today and we're not gonna go with our van we're gonna go quiet and we're gonna go with our legs why well, because I want to be stealthy and not lure a bunch of zombies to us with the van. Simple as that. Maybe I should have destroyed these uh, stairs. What the fuck is happening back here? Hey! Hey, you stop that! in there for you, zombie. How dare you try to smash yourself upon my doors here. Alright. <clears throat> here we are. Home sweet home. All outside. So, we're going to be running down this road. Um, one, two, three streets, basically. So let's get on the other side. And we'll start looking. I was thinking about taking some time to tear down some more wooden things in our in our house or in our apartment building, right? In order to, you know, gather things up. But we don't really need to do that right now. We're we're pretty secure. So I decided I'll just not waste my time and what we can do instead is go after the propane torch. Because that's what we really need right now. So I think we are passing the first road now. I'm crouching because I want a stealth experience. We're getting a little bit. Oh. Got a zombie. There we go. Anything on him? Also, how much do my crowbar have for damage left? Not bad. Okay. Also, walking around like this will allow us to kill zombies while also maintaining uh, progress, right? So we're not going to get, like, jumped by a huge horde of them, you know? We're going to be able to just kill some zombies as we progress, kill a few of them at a time that haven't grouped up, and uh, hopefully we can thin out their numbers a little bit for when we expand in the future. 
right? So it looks like we're pretty safe right now. Let's check the map just to double check our progress here. So yeah, we passed the first road. We still need to go two roads down. We're just gonna speed up a little bit here. Unfortunately, we are in a little bit of pain, but it only makes us more liable to trip. And we're just gonna try and wander past these guys. Gonna speed up just a little bit here. It looks like these zombies have been attracted by the sound. Not really much we can do here. I'm gonna try and take this one out real quick. Shit. Well, that's not gonna work. Fuck. Yeah, I somehow wandered into a huge group of them. That's not ideal for us at all. But it's all right, we're okay. I just don't have any more spare bandages, so if we get bitten again, we're gonna be in for a little bit of a bad time. Let's turn around and look. That's a, that's a horde there. So this is the second road. We've gotta go one more road over. So much for our stealthy approach, huh? Really hoping to thin out some more numbers, but that many just all of a sudden. I can't believe one zombie hitting like a window lured them all over like that. They're still coming at me, so I can't do much. Let's get to the next road, then we can try to lose them a little bit. Oh. Another zombie banging on shit back there. Okay. Oh, look. It looks like we have a uh, survivor house here. They might have a propane torch. Let's check that out first. Because we are going down the, the rest of the way here. So we're going to go ahead and unbarricade this. Luckily, we have a crowbar. Oh. That was close. Like, way too close, for being honest. Um, anyone else around this corner is going to come and get near us? Okay, anything else from this side? No. Let's try, let's try this again, unbarricade. All right, then we're gonna just open the window. We're gonna pry open the window. Okay, let's check our orders here. All right, looks like we're having a bit of a bad time. I'm gonna go over this way real quick. Oop. That was a bad idea. We're gonna get over here and... Okay, I was about to say, can I not jump that? That would have been really bad. Okay. Well, we managed to pop some pills, so that will hopefully uh, help us out there. I'm just gonna sit down real quick and we're gonna wait for a couple minutes. Now we're gonna get back up. The shit has gone south. Anyone over here? No? Okay. Oops. Thought I could open the door. I cannot. Are you guys fucking kidding me right now? Over. Okay, well. That's not great. Come on, I need to get in the house and find some clothing or something to stitch up these bang fucking wounds with. Really, no one's gonna have their house unlocked right now. Oh, for fuck's sake. Let me in. Is this a fucking dresser down here? It's not. Of course, they don't have any first aid shit in their fucking bathroom. Why the hell would they? Rip clothing. Oh, 
Okay. Let's go ahead and open up this window so I can escape out the back. Climb over this fence. Check my corners here. Oh, shit. Stay on the ground. Don't fuck with me, lady. Okay. I'm gonna take this double holster. Thank you. Okay, we've almost died. Um, this is not an ideal situation right now. Through we go. Okay. See if we can find a propane torch on our first try, huh? Pipe wrench and screws. Take these nails. Okay. How do you have a metalworking book but no propane torch? Okay, well, we can at least uh, take a moment to, to rest up in here. Did I have any other ripped sheets? I do, so I could replace these dirty bandages. And we can disinfect with our alcohol wipes. Another one just went dirty, that's great. Go ahead and... Uh, oh, my alcohol wipes are, are gone now. That's great. Yeah, we're just a little bit infected. That's fine. We're, we're going to be okay. Wait, was that open? Their garage doors are just open, huh? Okay. Kind of a... It must be like a safe neighborhood or something, huh? They're just leaving all their doors open. We're going through band-aids uh, really quickly. For bandages. We need to find some clothing and stuff we can... Just, I thought I saw, I see a propane tank. Is that going to put me overweight? No, thank God. We can use that to uh, build propane torches if we actually fucking find one. We got a propane tank, but no propane torch. Okay. Let's go up the block here. We might try to get into one of the houses and see if we can find any medical supplies. Um, we're just having no luck with what we're actually looking for at this point. We'll cross the street first here. Oh, we got a zombie. Yep. I'm going to uh, take some more painkillers since we are getting a little bit uh, pained here. Okay, what do we got here? Hiking bag, which is, I believe, worse than my current one. Yeah, because I have a big hiking bag. Uh, no propane torch yet. Ah, come on. I thought for sure we were going to die when the, that group of zombies like got on us and we were getting attacked from the back and stuff. That was... Just not, not, not great. I really want this other propane tank, but we don't have uh, enough uh, carrying weight right now. So we'll check these three garages. Oh, I completely missed that zombie. you got you got a key nice i'll take it i'm a key collector as they say um nothing 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 really 
This game really does not want me to get a propane torch for whatever reason. Okay. Fine, we'll just check these two more places. Maybe we can find one. More nails. Come on, someone has to have a propane torch. All these propane tanks and no propane torches. Brick toys, yada yada, yada yada. All right, well, still find it weird that they're all uh, just leaving their doors open. Let's check this. Let's say, let's check this garage. Yeah, I go over here, don't I? Can I pry this open? I can. No. Oh, okay. I thought it, uh... I thought it broke my... <laughs> oh my god. I was about to, like, be really upset because I thought that broke my crowbar. Mm, so there's no ways to get in other than there, huh? Ah, how about this window? Can I open it up? Got it. I'm through. Close this window. Okay. First, let's find something to eat in this house. Preferably something that's not canned food, because I really don't want to open it up. There we go. Alright, let's also go ahead and have a smoke. Before we go too far in here. That'll help us get rid of the anxiety we're feeling. Let's start searching here. See if there's anything we can use. First aid equipment. Um, anything of that sort. This is probably going to be the bathroom. And it has hairspray. Great. Love to see it. At least I can clean all the bandages that I have here. Take a drink and also fill my water bottle. Let's try and find, hopefully, some medical supplies up here, huh? Okay. Let's clear the rest of the house before we start looting any of the areas here. There we go. Got him down. How was he in the closet? Propane torch, though? No. Of course not. Why would there be a propane torch on him? Letter opener. Can I rip up any of this to make it into bandages? I can. There we go. All right. Next room. Another bathroom. Potentially medical supplies. We got some painkillers. A first aid kit, which has some stuff in it. Oops, not renamed. Place item. I'm gonna place it right there. Really nothing else in here, huh? I don't need a suture needle holder, but you know, I think I'll take it just because uh, I do sort of require one. Go ahead and wash myself. There we go. All right. That might help us uh, stay a little bit cleaner and less infected wounds and stuff. I don't know. Okay, it looks like we are in the clear. What about these pants? Can I rip them up? I can't. Do that real quick. How about these shelves? Ugh. A hunter's magazine, huh? We're just over here with infected wounds, and that's not great. 
We have an empty suitcase. We have a flight case, which uh, also doesn't matter. I thought it might have been a gun case, but nope. Nothing we can really use here. Um, what about the bedside? Do they maybe have some drugs? Oh, they have a, a gun. Can I put that in my holster? How much more does that weigh me down? A little bit. Fine. You know what? I'll, I'll take some of these. Might as well carry it around, right? All right. Um, And now we have exercise fatigue, too, which is not ideal. We're just going to go ahead and rebandage our wounds. Even though they're infected, it's probably best to, to do that. I think we just leveled up uh, first aid a bit. Right? First aid leveled up? Yeah, it did. Woo woo. Okay. Too much pain to sleep. Okay, well, we'll just take a couple painkillers then. I'm just going to drop these dirty rags on the ground here. Hopefully lighten my load a little bit. And then, uh... Hmm. What else am I carrying right now? A pain tank, suture needles, some ammunition. Okay. I'm gonna put these ripped sheets in my bag. Does that lighten me enough? It does not. Let's just speed up time real quick. No, the, the bed. The bed! The bed! There we go, we can sleep now. Okay. Slept for a little while. We're able to pass the time, so it's at least daylight out. Um, where are we at now? Here? Okay, so I'm gonna put down a marker there. Kind of try and signify that that is a house that has been boarded up for us, right? The real shame, no house seems to have medical supplies at all. How are these people, like, living them, their lives? There's, like, nothing I can use for disinfectant or anything either. Which is just bad. Um, let's have some peaches. Drop that on the ground. There we go. Uh, and then let's go ahead and clean these bandages. Go ahead and drink while we're at it. And then lastly, we'll just fill our water bottle. Make sure that that's maxed out. All right. More painkillers? Yep. Anything in the trash here? No. That's bad. They coming after me? They are. Okay. How far down this road did I go? I think I checked. I know I checked that one. Then I went over here. But was there any more further down? No, but there are these ones here. I'm gonna pop some beta blockers right now. Back looks clear. Let's lure these zombies over here. Hey! Boy, come at me! Didn't account for that one though. Can I maybe get him to fall over something? the next oh, come on why the fuck did I do that
Why am I fucking swinging at the air? I swear to God, my guy is sometimes just so brain dead. Like, what the fuck? Come on. For real? Are you kidding me right there? Now he decided to swing at the ground when everyone else was just standing up, huh? Okay. going back now. What does this do? Trip chance, reduce speed, yada yada. Okay. I got an idea. Propane tank, drop! I don't need it. We don't even have a fucking thing to handle. A thing that uses propane yet, so it's uh, kind of pointless to have one, don't you think? One of these houses has to be open. Come on. I can maybe take these zombies out. that way. Back to here, please, so we can take some more painkillers. These places have backy uh, sheds in the backyard. Doesn't look like it. Okay. We're clear in the back. Let's take this guy out. Go. You have anything on you, sir? No. Actually, how's that hoodie? Is that any better for me? No. Okay, let's take out this zombie here. Got him. Nice. All right. Now then, can I get into this house? The answer is yes, but also no. this house. Oh, no, they're going to just be lured directly into there, aren't they? <clears throat> I think it's time to jump this fucking wall, too, now. I think we'll just sit for a moment. Catch our breath. zombies, but I don't know where they're at. Let's risk it. Why are there so fucking many right here? They should, shouldn't they have followed me down there? Why are there so many still up right around here? Ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous, dude. Oh, hey, look. It's, uh... Apocalypse House. I don't know if I've searched that one yet. Maybe I have. I don't know. I'll figure it out. There's dead people in that one. Alright, over we go. How's it going, sir? I'm gonna just kill you real quick since you're the only one back here. Okay, and then we're just gonna take a smoke. 
We're getting a little anxious. Okay. And let's go ahead and eat some painkillers. Okay. Get them distracted over there. Let's jump to the next house, which was this one that was boarded up. I think it's the next house over, too. Can't even get into here, so. Keep over again. Okay. This back area is fairly secure. I'm gonna sit on the ground. We're gonna wait a minute. Alright. Well, obviously, the door is probably gonna be locked, so let's just unbarricade these doors. Or these windows. I can just throw the planks on the ground. This house isn't secure since we, uh. Oh, I could just pry it open out of the ship. Alright, let's crouch down. Out through the window. Alright. Now, quietly, take a peek at what they have in here. Maybe they'll have a propane torch for me. Just some canned foods, huh? Okay, what about the fridge? What you got in your fridge? Rotten stuff, of course. Makes sense. Bookcase. Nothing special. Let's, uh, fuck. Okay. We're taken care of. Don't worry about it. Take a look, shelves. Nothing. All right. That also has nothing on them. Nothing storage-wise in there. Oh my god. Literally... I think all three of those doors have a zombie behind them. Anyone else in here? No? Okay. Or maybe just the two of them? What about this house? Or this not house, the door. Tell you what, I'll replace my crowbar with this crowbar. So that way we uh, just have a better condition. Where the fuck did they come from? I'm going downstairs now. Where the fuck did those two zombies come from? Did they just walk in? Okay, let's take some painkillers, and maybe I'll go up there and deal with them. Yeah, yeah, jump scare music. Oh, there's fucking three up here? Jesus Christ, bro. Come on. The fuck off me. Why the fuck would you do... Get the fuck away from me. Get the fuck away from me right now. I'm pushing you down. Fucking stop. What the fuck was that? Those zombies should not have been there. They had to have, like, spawned there or something. 
Because they were not downstairs or anywhere outside when I fucking went in there. Okay, Brandon has died. Let's go with Harry Spellman now. Harry Spellman is going to find a weapon and fucking deal with this garbage because he's pissed. Apparently, Perry Spellman decided to just fucking yell because he's an idiot. Can't keep his fucking mouth shut. So he's quickly going to fucking look around and see if there's any weapons in his damn house. Why does no one have fucking medical supplies? <sighs> ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Alright. Where the fuck are we at? So we were... Somewhere around here. I think. Is there like a question mark symbol I can use? No. Oh, there is. I just need, like, a, a pen. Uh, somewhere around there. I don't fucking know. Alright, where is he at? Oh, great. He's way down here. Okay, well, good news. It looks like we might have... Oh, was that another door down here that I didn't see? No, that was just the kitchen. Never mind, let's go outside. Good news is, it looks like he has a garage of some sort. Come on, man. It's your own fucking window. Don't, 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 don't do that. I'll take a, uh... Okay, the metal bar is stronger. I'll take that instead. Yep. Fine, I don't give a shit. Just fucking bash the damn window in. One of these motherfuckers, somewhere, has to have a fucking propane torch. I, I, I don't get it. How does no one have a fucking propane torch? I can use the damn door. We need to head north, right? Yeah. Okay. So Carrie is a bit of a psychic. He knows things. And he was friends with uh, our first guy, whose name I forget, and Brendan. And uh, he just had a sixth sense that, oh, maybe my friend Brendan just, uh, just died. So he's going to go up to where he thinks his friend died and uh, try and help out here. Is that a... Nah, it's just a long arm, huh? Fine. I'll just smash the window after I'm done dealing with these ladies. You know what? For some reason, a dash elite key? I don't even know what the hell that is. Not this.
First of all, pop the trunk. Check the glove box for a key. No key. That's fair. We are safe. Okay. Why don't we go ahead and open the box of shells. Insert the ammunition into the shells here. There we go. You're good to go. This pistol has no ammunition for it. Also, that's a rifle round there. I'm gonna go ahead and place this uh, on the ground and we're just gonna take these first aid items. All right, so which car is uh, the one that had the car keys there? We do need like one chunk of the map still. Ooh, I think that's a chunk of the map we needed. Noise. More bandages, I'll take them. Yeah, now if we look, we have uh, that. So we just need one more little chunk of the map, that area. We'll be able to see what was there. Nothing. Ah, so this is the uh, vehicle in question. Does it have gas is the question, though. Anything in the trunk? No. Well, let's see if it can drive. Nope, because we're out of fuel. Okay. So if we had a gas can, we could uh, go in there, huh? Oh, it's just a magazine. I was like, what is that on the ground? Search the rest of these cars then. Screwdriver. matches. We're going to need to smoke, so we might as well try it right. Smash the window. Or cigarettes, or bandages. Nothing else important. How about the trunk? What you got in you, huh? Hey, gas can. Doesn't have any gas in it either. This is fucked, bro. There, siphon gasoline. How much gas did I get from that? Barely any. Okay. Well, you know what? We're gonna add some gasoline here then. And I'm gonna check these cars over here real quick. See if they maybe have any gasoline in them. Siphon gas. Oh, there we go. Yeah, that should be enough. One gas can should last us a uh, little while here. Add gasoline. Okay. I'm just going to go to the trunk. Put this gas can in. We're going to go ahead and re-equip the shotgun. All right, let's rock and roll, boys and girls. So, looking at it from where we're at right now, we need to go up quite a bit far, so we're gonna come out here, go up here, turn left, then turn right, essentially. All right. Bro, shift. Shift the gear. Oh, I hate that, dude. That, like, high revving. Is just awful. We're gonna turn left and we're gonna turn right. Oh, look, we're in the fancy neighborhood. Ooh. 
Fuck out of my way. This is not where I wanted to turn, I guess. That's fine. Fuck, this really was the fancy neighborhood. My god. Remove the barricade. Fortunate. Did they already smash through? No. Well, we got some friends, it looks like. Well, I will train uh, some shooting while we're at it. God damn, Carrie is a fucking nurture born killer. I had him over here just fucking lining up shots. I got through the barricade of that door anyway. I'm gonna lure him back here. I love this, sir. I'm just gonna walk past you now. Come on, zombies! Over here! We can get my shooting and aiming up here. Luckily, we have a nice little park area. having an issue with uh, firing a shot and then not racking it afterwards because that one zombie is a little bit too close to me. Right, let's reload again. How much we got left? Eight shotgun shells, six, five, four, three, two. All right. Ooh, you got a gun on your back there, sir? Or is that just a fucking knife? It's like just a knife hatchet. All right, come on, zombies. Back to me. Come on. Let's line some more of your little bitch asses up so I can kill you. I held a Q. Apparently that did. Come on, y'all. A little bit closer. I'm gonna just run through over here. That way I can group them up a little bit closer. A little bit tighter, you know what I'm saying? Gotta make sure I rack it before we fire again. Heard the rack. Let's reload the rest of these bullets in here. Yeah. Rack the fucking gun. Oh, yeah, we're out. Okay. Alright, come on this way. Hey, come on. Over here. Let's go. 
I should probably equip one of my metal bars. Just to have it ready. We also need to have something to drink. I suppose I can find anything neat on these zombie bodies here while I I'm go through here like, real quick. Nope. Okay. Got a water bottle on you? Nope. Not in the trash. Wait, over here, you lot. All right. I'm gonna juke him. Go through the goalpost. Why the fuck are there zombies walking up that way? I don't get what the, the way some zombies path. It's just odd. You suppose this is open back here? Nah. Why would it be? Of course, there's a goddamn army out there. I'm just gonna really quick drink from the sink before I fucking starve to death or whatever. Grab one. Grab more shotgun shells. Grab the revolver. Grab that. Grab more shotgun shells. Okay. Ooh, we got some more weapons in here. Spear, a spiked baseball bat. You know what? I like the fucking metal bar. Nope, get off me, sir. I want nothing that you're selling. Oh, fucking bastards. <sighs> okay. Well, why don't we have ourselves a celebratory smoke after killing this many motherfuckers, huh? And we just started and we killed 42. Probably eat some chips too while we're at it, huh? Hey, lady. Fuck you doing, huh? Paint your house. We're trying to knock on it. I'm gonna put on this jacket. Surprisingly, that other jacket that I had apparently was not that good, huh? I think I'll drop the M9 since I don't have any ammo for it. That way I'm not carrying as much. How many zombies have we killed? 43, just from, you know, doing our thing. Right, let's see if I can get these zombies who are in the front of the house to... Oh, they all decided to go over there. Cool, now they're coming this way for some weird reason. I'm gonna head back here. Are they just fucking around up there now, or? Yeah, I think they're just playing with the fence for some reason. Okay. Whatever. As long as they're not bugging me.
I think those guys really want to get in, don't they? Finally, a house that has fucking medical supplies, huh? we got here earbuds in a newspaper flame flame okay so there's nothing else in this house that i uh i need great All right, well in that case um i'm gonna have to go get my car but how many zombies are out here knocking on the door just two of them okay I can deal with this. Hey, buddy! Okay, you guys got anything on you, huh? Real quick, real quick, real quick. Nope, and nope. All right. <laughs> Later on, dudes! Keep that RPM high so the fucking zombies can hear me. That's a great idea, good sir. It's a good thing that Brandon decided to write down his uh, memoirs in that book so that uh, Carrie here Look, it's another uh, house that's boarded up and stuff. We can take a look at that. Come here. Come on, I won't bite. I mean, I might bash a little, but definitely won't bite. Right, let's try to use this fence to buckle up. As long as I don't get blanked from the back. We're doing a pretty damn good job here, so. I don't fucking whiff like that. Come on, fuck off. Oh, come on, come on. Why did I not hit that second hat? Oh my god. Second fucking attack. Why did it not hit? Why did I just push him over instead of fucking hitting his ass? One more dead? Fucking zombie bastards. Think you can just come into here and Kill me? Well, I say no. Hi, hey guys. Going for a walk? Want to come over the fence, maybe? Now they do. As soon as I wasn't ready for them, they all decided to come over the fence, huh? Sorry, lady. I don't taste good. You should, uh, fuck off. Stuck on a bush. Push him back. Thought for sure I was going to get bit there. Alright, over we go. Fucking 
good. Okay. And that really was just like a naked zombie just chilling there, huh? the zombies who are pounding away at this house, the ones who are inside of it. I would say probably. Yeah, probably. Oh, fuck, there's a huge horde right there. Meow. Can I get into this house? Please. Mm. Hey, lady, you wanna, 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 yeah, come here, come here. that window real quick. Okay, there we go. We got a key. Excellent. Why can't I get the... Fanny pack, hell yeah. We got some military boots, hell to be yeah. Means I can put my matches and cigarettes and this stuff in my fanny pack, along with the pen, which will help a little bit to light me up. I can also drop these shoes that I'm carrying. I need to find a bottle of some sort, because our water situation is not ideal. Do you have anything in your kitchen that can help with that, friends? No. Sleeping tablets, I'll take those, because I'm in pain. Mm. More sleeping tab. Oh. Can't take them if I walk away from them. Backpack would be also just really swell, you know. Or just a propane torch so I can, you know, go about my fucking business and not have to worry about what else is around here, you know. Gonna sleep. I should snag a watch too while I'm at it. I had a sling, I could put it on my back instead of carrying it around, which would help my weight out a bit. Really, there's a back door to this place, right? That's a no, there's not. Open this window. Right, let's go. Doesn't look like that window has barricade on it. All right. in the uh, living room area here. No. All right. Perfect. How about the rest of the house? We got a trunk with, of course, nothing in it. Ooh, a gas mask? Fuck yeah. First time I've seen one of these. I can go ahead and remove these safety goggles and... Uh... Yeah. It'd be nice if I could see in here. What do we got here? Whole bunch of nothing. Hmm? Go all the way around here. I can see what's in this bookshelf, which is also nothing. 
won't be anything in that corner. How about here? A hunting knife. Great. Yeah, just what I wanted to have. I didn't search this room yet. Oh, a red pen. Yay. You know what? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say it. I'm going to say it. This house sucks. It's bad. They, they barely have any supplies in here. Like, how did they even survive at all? Wait, I can drink? It's drink, not eat. Okay. Can I fill this tin can up? No. Do I really not have anything that I can, like, grab to, like, drink out of as I progress? This house didn't even have a fucking stash of weapons. Okay, well, I'm going to go back through here, then. Not this one. fucking smash the window. Someone on this earth has to have a fucking propane torch. Somebody, literally anybody, do you have a propane torch? There's really no windows on this fucker. Okay. Okay. I see how it is. I see how we're playing this fucking game. What up, zombies? You're all fucking losers. <laughs> Get fucking juked. Later on, dudes. to go. Actually, basically at the corner. Uh, so that's perfect. I think I had a huge hat. I don't mind if this car gets a little bit bumpy. It's fine. Okay, that was bad. I almost fucking hit that pole. Yeah, there's where I died right there. A lot of zombies over there. All right. Oop. Come on, you lot. You want some? Come fucking get some. Luckily, apparently panic doesn't throw off my my aim, so that's really nice. Run, 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 run. Turn. Run, 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 run. Turn. And we 
reload. Hell yeah, brother. Whoop, you almost had me. Almost had me. Almost had me. Oh. Gotta reload. How much more we got? I know we have another box left, too, so... Not too worried about running out quite yet. Can't open a box of shells uh, while moving, so let's go ahead and open it now. Here we go, and we'll continue our reload. Oop, run past those guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're you're panicking. I know. And now we reload again. All right, other reload, let's go. collect them again. No sense freaking out. We're fine. We're all right. All right. A little distance. Turn. Fire! Fire! Move again. That's where we want to go, so... I don't like wasting a shotgun shell and just like one little straggler who's just hanging out, you know? It's, it's just such a waste. So let's collect them up a little bit better. And pow! Right in the kisser! Didn't cock it after that. Damn. Oops, didn't cock it again. That was the last shotgun shell I have, so everything that's in here is all we got. Get them tighter by going through the crowd here. Get them nice and tight. We can get our groupings together. Come on. I know y'all want to play. Let's go. Shit. Didn't cock it. Go. I'm just gonna run in a circle real quick to get that guy tighter. There we go. Shit, we're out. We are out. Drop it. All right. Next, let's equip our. Oops, not secondary. My bad. Hold on. Equip primary. Don't mind me, zombies. I'm just loading my gun to kill you. Uh oh. Was that five? Yep. One, two, Three, four, five, and reload. Oh, are we done? We out of this too?
Yep, on the ground that goes. Alright, we'll lose the zombies now. What a fucking little ritzy house, goddamn. Ooh, a plastic cup. I'll take that, because I can fill that up, and we'll be able to drink from it. Nice. While all the zombies are messing around, I'm going to just sneak around up here. See what I can find. See if there's anything interesting here. I'm not going to worry too much about books or anything like that. But if they have medical supplies or cigarettes or bourbon or, you know, literally anything, that would be great to have. Use some more alcohol wipes to make sure that's really not going to get infected. There we go. Okay. They're rich people. They have to have some sort of, like, stuff in here, right? We got razors, freezers, beta blockers, some cologne, a bandage. Oh, they got some tweezers. Damn. Oh, really, huh? Okay, okay, okay. Well, as long as that's, you know, something. Sleeping tablets. I have any backpacks? They're rich, right? Come on, we have to have like. Oh yes, we go camping every like two weeks, and it's really great. So we uh, do stuff. I don't know. There's three stories to this. Oh my god! It really, is a fancy house. Jesus Christ. More cologne. I would just like a, a backpack, maybe. Not a briefcase. Not a suitcase. I already have gloves. I don't need fingerless ones. Let's see, cologne. Adhesive bandages. We've got another more adhesive bandages. I'll take them. Can I wash myself? I'm a little bit dirty, but I think we're fine otherwise. Alright, yeah, our guy, uh... Fucking Carrie, man! Carrie Spellman has been doing work. He has been making the zombies' lives just a living hell. And, uh, I approve of every ounce... Oh my god, it goes even higher? I guess it's an attic, okay. Surely they have like a propane torch here, right? They're rich, you know. Come on. Come on. I just gotta have a propane torch, right? Every time I see this, I'm like, Vault Tech Radio? Okay, well, they have nothing for me then. I'm gonna go downstairs. Hopefully, get back to where my, uh,. Where our previous friend died at. <clears throat> and ignore that real quick. And, uh, temple fence. Alright, so where did we die? It was. Center on me. Enhance. Enhance. Just across the street. Okay. We're gonna wander out here then. I'm gonna jump this fence. Kinda see. <laughs> You can see the, the path that I took. The path of destruction and death. It's really evident where I had been. And where I had gone. Okay. Walk back. Not really interested in... Dueling with a bunch of zombies at once. So let's just fucking 
uh, figure out what we're gonna do here. South, go! Alright. Made it down. Time to crawl once again. No, Brandon, my friend. I cannot believe you died here. How unfortunate. Don't worry, Brandon. I will make up for your death by carrying on your legacy as well as everyone else. A hockey helmet? Okay. Get rid of this ear protection. All right, what else did we have? We had these uh, black leather trousers, denim shirt. We had a double holster. We had a back fanny pack, which we're going to wear on our back. Excellent. Um, hammer, which we're going to attach to the belt on the left. I don't really want to wear the hockey mask, even though it is better. Um, I would still prefer to not do that, so holster left that one. Already got military boots, that's fine and dandy. Painkillers, we got our bulletproof vest. Finally got our watch back now. Screwdriver attached to the right belt here. We already have tweezers, and we got some water bottles finally, so our guy's not gonna starve or anything. I'm gonna place this fanny pack right here so I can access it to get the rest of my goodies. There we go. All right. Um, what the fuck else am I carrying right now? All right, I'm carrying this extra clothing. No, just drop it on the floor, please. Come on. There we go. What else am I carrying? Mm. How much of these way? Quite a bit. I'm gonna just drop these ripped sheets that we had. All right, and then what else? Let's see. Let's put these here. Put the cologne here. Plastic cup with water, we can just throw on the ground now. I don't care a shit about that. Uh, suture needle can go in the bag. Our metal bar that we have to spare can go in the bag. Actually, you know what? Let's drop this metal bar and we'll just equip this metal bar. I would take the crowbar back, but I think the, the problem we were running into is um, we were having an issue with how much we were... Uh, it, it was... It weighed too much or something, I don't know. Now then. Are we going to find anything in here that will be useful to us? Other than food. Because imagine Brandon dying for absolutely fucking nothing. Oh look, another gas mask. We were literally moments away from getting another gas mask. And yet, it was ripped from our hands because zombies decided that they were going to be little bitches. Which means there's no propane torch in here. God damn it. Okay, well, I can at least mark that this house is that one. I can remove that. So we can try to make our way towards that blue house. says as he runs out into a group of zombies. Hey y'all, don't mind me, just, just a guy running through backyard here. 
I take some beta blockers. Hey man, come on. You too, lady. Come on over. Look at how much quicker I'm dispatching these zombies with a pipe instead of a crowbar now. I think metal pipes are just the way to go. Let's just get the fuck out of this street. Okay. We're going to go ahead and sit down for a moment here. And we will just wait until we are happy again. There we go. We're still carrying too much because our guy is still a fucking weak little bitch. Ooh, a key. Nice. And a revolver, I guess, huh? Anyway, let's go ahead and open up this beef stroganoff. Okay. Oh shit. Nee, 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 nee. Where was that house at? Oh, right down there? Fuck. Okay. <laughs> oh. Was this one? Yeah. It is, which means I can just unbarricade this guy. And open up the window. And then drop this plank before I get into trouble. And then re-equip this metal bar before I freaking forget. And it causes me some pain. Well, they ain't trying to get in here anyway. Key, key. The key collection is growing, Brandon. Do not worry, I will keep your, um, your legacy going. The key collector will remain. Shame there's nothing in there, though. Alright, come on. Come on, propane torch, propane torch. How fucking dare you. Two of y'all, huh? What were y'all doing before you turned, huh? Oh, really? Why would I go after the guy on the ground and not the one in front of me, huh? Huh? Wanna fucking ask that for me? Let's use cologne to disinfect it. That was so dumb. Sometimes the attacking in this game is just a little bit stupid. Put in these leather gloves and I can get rid of these other ones. Yeah. 
four leather gloves. A gun case. Ooh. Let's go ahead and place this down on the ground. And then from the gun case, I'll go ahead and just add this deagle into my uh, my right holster so that way we're carrying all the guns we can. I'm going to go ahead and place these into my bag here then. And while we're at it, let's go ahead and change these bandages. What is even the point of having a safe house if you don't have a propane torch? Okay, well... Alright, ladies and gentlemen, let's wrap things up here. I know we can still go home and we have a vehicle and whatnot, but for hell's sake, guys. What is even happening at this point? Right? We were Brandon, what's his name? And he sadly perished trying to find a propane torch to help the base even more. Luckily, Brandon and whoever else his friend was before, they knew a psychic named Carrie Spellman. And Carrie, who was hoarding up at his house because he knew that would be one of the safest places to be for a while, also knew about his friends who were going about their time trying to survive the zombie apocalypse. And so Carrie, he just waited, bided his time, knowing that they would do the work for him while he could remain safe at home. And then, when his friends met their untimely end, he knew he finally had to get going. Because he had no more friends, and he was the last one. However, that's not to say that Brandon and the other guy didn't have other friends who also know about the plan to go to take the hospital and would also be trying to do it themselves. So anyway, Carrie just happened to be psychic and know exactly where Brandon died. That's all that out was. Throwing it out there. Okay. So next time when we come back, we're gonna... I don't even fucking know, guys. Like, how do we not have a single propane torch anywhere? We're gonna have to start searching, like, these black buildings up at the docks or something i think we'll yeah we'll we'll do that next time we'll we'll go to the apartment drop off the stuff we're carrying now then we'll come back down here or uh, we'll go back up there to where the docks are at and uh i i guess we're gonna try to search and find a warehouse that would have torch like stuff in it like we found down at maldrew can i open up the map do i have a maldrew map i do so if we go over here, kind of like the areas that were down here and also up here, they were just huge warehouses that had like a bunch of equipment. I'm pretty sure they had like a bunch of like propane torches. So that'll be the plan next time. We're going to escape from here, get in our car, drive back home, drop stuff off, then go up north in the red car. We're not going to take the van, I don't think. We'll just keep the uh, the red one for now. The van will stay at home. Unless we need to transport a bunch of stuff, like trees and stuff, for example. But until then, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time as Carrie Spellman.